Hello, family. Thank you for coming over to the house tonight. And just kick off your shoes and relax your feet. Party on down to the SKB. We're kicking. Just kick it. Just kick it. Okay, you don't come to another episode where we're going to be asking the question of... Why are you telling my business? Don't be telling my business. Hmm. Why not? Because a can-can and a can-can, a can-can, a can-can, and a wheel. Now we're off to... Hello, everyone, and welcome back to the channel. Okay, I'm trying to crank out some videos for y'all so y'all can get y'all kikis, y'all laughs on, and y'all opinions down in the comments. Hey, welcome to the channel. And we're going to be talking about Marlo Hampton. Yes, we got to be a little bit messy because they were messy before I got on him. <laughs> You all know that my little Hampton got a peach. She's a peach holder for this season of the Real Housewives of Atlanta. And she wanted somebody to throw her a peach party, honey. And guess who she picked, y'all? Guess who she picked? She picked her arch enemy, Portia Williams, ex fiance, ex baby daddy, Dennis McKinley. Don't y'all see that invitation? Nyack. <laughs> and if anybody don't know, Nyack is a cognac that Dennis McKinley made up, sold it, boxed it, and put it out for the masses of consumers to partake of. Yes! None other than Portia Williams' baby daddy. <laughs> I know you feel like a fool right about now. And guess who she invited to the brunch or dinner, however it was? She invited Fallon, y'all. Y'all know who Fallon is? Yes. She didn't invite Portia. That's for certain, though. Woo! That is a slap in the face. Because do you see that background with Dennis in the background? In his picture? His photo op? It's Nyack. That's his brand. And what do y'all see right there? That's Nyack. <laughs> and Marlo is serving it up. Yes, Marlo Hampton. Had her little peach party thrown on behalf of Dennis McKinley, which happens to be her baby's daddy. Yes, her ex fiance. Yes, okay. It seems like Portia should be at that peach party now, doesn't it? But her and Milo fell out <laughs> because Kenya allegedly was talking to everyone at the house when they were celebrating Cynthia's uh, nuptials to Mike. And they said she slept with Bolo child. So that was like breaking news. Breaking news, honey. Marlo done said it all. Ooh, I know Portia is too fit to be tied and she do not want to see any of those pictures on social media. But yes, <laughs> <laughs> Dennis laughing at her ass. Yes, he probably won't speak ill of her in public. But who behind them closed doors by his close friends that know him and they down for him like four fat tires, ten toes up. Okay. He be he probably more than likely be wearing Portia ass out. Okay. And I think with Dennis doing this was a good thing. And it's good advertisement for him. But I think he did it also for a little jab. Yes, a little jab to Portia and Simon. Because they've definitely been flossing. And, and and I don't know how you buy your so-called fiancé a Rolls Royce. Then turn around and give her a Mercedes Benz. Now, we do know which one is higher than the other one. The Rolls Royce is one of your very big lucrative luxury line cars okay but she gonna drop back to a mercedes benz now tell me what's wrong with that picture tell me what's wrong with that picture but we got dennis laughing at her <laughs> Woo! he probably had a drink with marlo about her and her downfall with how she treated him gonna try to put him in a mexican jail over over her cousin and her allegations child marlo was having pleasure 
in posting and promoting that. Yes, that's enough. That's enough internet for now. Yes, it is. With Portia getting dragged through the internet by her ex-baby daddy and her ex-friend and pretty much her ex-co-worker. Because she's not on the Real Housewives of Atlanta right now. Yes, it's a it's a pitiful, pitiful thing that Portia finds herself in. I'm like, isn't that funny? Isn't that funny, y'all? That her baby daddy would be sponsoring her enemy, her foe party. Okay? And I'm pretty sure she had some words for Dennis. She probably more than likely told her, why are you doing that for her? She need to do it for herself or let somebody else do it. But no, Portia, guess what? He committed to it. And he served it up for her. Okay. Because she is a peach holder. And you are not. Okay. You are not. So whatever you call yourself doing. These two ladies are living their best life honey. They are showing up and showing out. And partying together. And laughing at you. Wondering where or when. You will be looking at this video. <laughs> And like Candy Burr said to Nene Leakes, you, or I should say, Fallon Pina and Marlo will be embedded in your MF brain, Portia. In your MF brain. And that peach holding, how she holding it, making me think she might be back on the Real Housewives of Atlanta. Now, wouldn't that be some shit, y'all? Uh, Father Time might shit in his clothes, okay, and turn over <laughs> and waddle in it. But I was also wondering, uh, from looking at um, Fallon's Instagram account, a, a lot of pictures do uh, represent or resemble a lot of pictures Portia has taken. And one of my family members, you know, put me on to that. <coughs> Excuse me. Put me on to Fallon Pena's uh, Instagram account. I forgot what family member it was. Because all of y'all are so nice. Y'all always try to keep me in the know of stories that y'all feel I can bring out in visual form. And give y'all a little comedy on the side. And, uh, should I be forgetting y'all names? Sometimes I'll be trying to, uh, like, screenshot it or write it down. And then when I get into my room to start taping. I don't be doing what that shit is. <laughs> so y'all got to love on me anyway. And I'll probably find it after this. I finish making this video. But I will try to include my family member's name. Who told me to go over here and check this shit out. Okay. So I did go on her uh, Instagram account. And she definitely has some similar pictures. Of some poses. Uh, Portia called herself taking out. And putting on social media. But honey, baby, I was like, God damn, you got three people not liking you. And they showing your ass up, Portia. They partying without you. And they got your ex-boyfriend toting the bill. And he is like, that's giving me more publicity. When I'm shown on the Real Housewives of Atlanta. Or I'm shown. <coughs> Excuse me. Of get sleepy, y'all. This is gonna be my last video too. Uh, when he's getting free promotion by catering to the, some of the staff or, or co-workers on the Real Housewives of Atlanta, that's giving him more uh, advertisement worldwide. You see what I'm saying? So he knows when he see a good marketing marketing tool being used. So, honey, y'all remember that picture? Of Porsche was taking. She had the same white beater on, and she was. Doing something around the pool while a father times out there playing golf and she was doing something. I like that's what she was trying to get that she was mimicking Fallon. So I'm like, Portia, stop being a copycat, babe. Stop being a copycat. Be an original, all right. But I can't wait till that particular book of uh, that Fallon Pina is bringing out, Sinless. Yes, honey, Sinless. It's supposed to be a mouth watering novel to read okay and i'm i'm right there i you know i bought portia so you know i'm gonna buy hers and just see what i can feel 
or interpret that she may be talking about Simon as well as Portia and how their union actually came to be in her words her perspective from her mouth all right so I was like okay then all right hopefully we'll get that book soon more sooner than later you know so I'm hoping it drops um in the summertime now i really think one of my family members did tell me on youtube when it was but you know y'all don't fit the ball i can't be thinking i can be thinking a whole lot of stuff in my brain it just leaks out from here to there but yeah y'all i had to bring out this video for y'all i was like oh i can't sit on this one. Oh no 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 Woo, that was a major slap in the face from a friend that she thought was a friend but from what marlo say coming from her mouth Portia messed that relationship up and we know how she messed up the relationship between Dennis his mom and put a riff in their family ever being blended has how she wanted it to be but I'm like Portia just tears up everything she destroys everything and you know the apple don't fall for far from the tree because her mother seems to be doing a lot of devilish stuff as well because ain't no way in the world i'll be having my mama shaking her tail feather in front of my man it just it's just not kosher it's just disrespectful and diane should know better she's damn near her 60s something 60 plus and she doing stuff like that i mean no 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 it may be a, a new way of thinking and it may be going towards a new world of ordering things like they're not where they once were they're not as how they were but now it's like the bad is good and the good is bad it's basically what i'm trying to say but i'm like morals and values are still a pinnacle point that everybody should have in their life everything dealing with ethical behavior and behavior and values and that's just don't seem like that runs on Portia Williams her mother's side of the family okay so I guess that's why um her husband's side didn't care too much for Diane all right because you know Elizabeth uh, Williams she didn't look like she cared for her at all she like she's on Diane's side of the family she married into this family but we don't put up with her or her family's antics okay and i was like i see i see on it portia was more around her mama side and picking up her mama ways <coughs> than on her daddy's side so that 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 was a trip that was a trip but i hope y'all enjoyed this video and uh i won't be back tonight but i'll be back hopefully on thursday giving y'all more of the same thing but a different twist so y'all can get another laugh off me free of charge because <laughs> i be damn tripping myself out sometimes when i be making these videos guys i be tripping my own damn self out so peace and love and blessings to you all and i'll see y'all next video Bye bye